Okay, so we've got this function here, y equals e to the power of sine 3x, and we're asked to differentiate it. Now, if you look at this function, there are three things in here. There's 3x, there's a sine function, and there's an exponential function. Now, any one of them individually are pretty easy to differentiate. So if I said to you y equals 3t, and I asked you for the derivative of that, pretty easy. If I said to you y equals sine, let's say theta, then the derivative of sine is cos. Or if I said to you y equals e to the z, then the derivative of that is e to the z. So we've got three functions here, but they're uh, combined. So it's 3x, take the sine of that, and then e to the power of that. So we use the chain rule. So the chain rule says that if you've got two functions, y equals f of g of x, then the derivative equals the derivative of f times the derivative of g. And, in fact, it works uh, in more than one, to more than one level as well. So if you've got three functions like that, then the derivative of that is f derivative times derivative of g times derivative of h. Now, you don't often get it in this format with three of them. Um, the chain rule is usually written in this format, which is two, but actually it's exactly the same thing. So now that we know that, this is pretty easy to differentiate because we've got the 3x function, we've got the sine function, and we've got the e function, and all we have to do is differentiate each of them individually and write down the answer. So. Let's do them from left to right. So the e function first. So the derivative is, okay, so we've got this, um, let's apply this rule here. Uh, we've got e to the power of something. The derivative of that is exactly the same. So e to the power of sine 3x. Okay, now let's apply this function here because that one is next in, in the sequence. Um, the derivative of uh, the sine function is cos. So it's a cos of 3x. And now let's finally apply this one here. Uh, the derivative of 3x is just 3. OK, so that's our answer. The derivative is, let's just simply um, neaten that up, 3 cos 3x e to the power of sine 3x.